Hello again, RWL fans. I'm Colin, with this edition of RWL Highlight Reel, and we'll be looking over some really great moments from recent RWL matches, where major championship belts changed hands. First, let's check out the rather controversial win by Gary Galaxy over longtime former champion, Scotty Priest, at the house show in Montreal, on June 26th, just a little over a week ago. Let's check out the real. The championship on the line, a champion on high alert. Ladies and gentlemen, we're in store for something special. Countered it just in time. Down. Wow, springboard attack. Both wrists captured. Oh, my lord. Just a soaring. Diving foot stop to the oh, new champ. Champion. I can't believe the ref didn't get two here. He moves just in time. An agile escape. Hurricane Climbing the turnbuckle now. From the heavens, a big body splash from the top. Knees meet the face. Oh my god. This is no time to hesitate. You can feel the end coming. Oh, a spin! The title's in jeopardy here! I think the paradigm is shifted. We almost had a new champion. Based on what we just saw, Operation Mountie as that last move couldn't. Uh oh. Way too far. Oh, now, trampling the opposition. Galaxy has been fighting back the hatred from fans with a very pragmatic approach, stating that no one can be champion forever, even citing himself as an example. Should be an interesting title run. Up next, a look at the super heavyweight title match from RWL main event, with the big boss man overcoming the Mexican monolith, Warlord Santos. Let's get after it. Entertain the possible adrenaline. 
And Bossman evades that. DDT planet. Big boss man is known to have a shoulder. We'll be oh, bear hug squeezing the breath out of them. This won't win the match, but it's doing a lot of damage in the process. Oh, that bear hug and a way to get out of it is being on display right here. Boom, running STO plants him. Nicely done. And he gets set back into the ring. Here's the pin title on the line. And it's a kick out at one for the defending champion. Kicking out there really has to make his opponent question his game plan. It wasn't the higher distance that caused the damage, but they certainly contributed. Something. Boss Man's looking powerless to every attack. Yeah, Boss Man's on the wrong side of every exchange. Fires back with a crucial elbow. The long arm of the law, hoping to start a rush of his own with that attack. Bodies must be writhing in pain right now. The breaking point must be on the horizon. But yet they continue forward, showing no desire to quit. From the middle rope. Man's win has made Warlord Santos a bitter enemy at this point, and we'll have to wait and see what develops between them. Next, the Coco Beach Wunderkind dropped the Snarl Television Championship to the Boogeyman, a member of the Sectarians, now guided by Father James Mitchell. Jackson, was that your alarm clock? This guy freaks me out! They are ready for battle! Forgive me for the lack of information on this title, but I have heard that it's highly coveted. But well, my sources sent me a VHS tape of this title's greatest matches, and there were some all-time classics. Really? Hey, can I borrow that tape, Corey? Absolutely not, Saxon. I'd be doing a disservice to my sources. Ah, he's got that boot right up against his face. Come on. Face crusher. Dropping bombs right now and escapes. Oh my god, no moonsault. Stationary position, turns around. Well, oh. I oh, able to counter. Yeah. Oh, the challenger not looking good right now. Yeah, Cole, but at this point in the match, you still haven't lost the edge. Oh, oh that'll weaken your arm. Work being done to the boogeyman. Boomsaw, incredible agility. Wait, darkness has just come over us here. And a palpable sense of fear has almost instantly emerged all around us, Cole. Bad predicament right here. Ooh, bad landing. Elbow drop. The here see it. Boogeyman. Ryan 
tying the big bad boogeyman up. Boogeyman tied that one. Able to parry that one. Lights up. DDT connects. We knew it was not going to be an easy task to put the champion away. Boogie Man with his grip since Steve with the Boogie Man. The title will change hands. Two count. Amazing. This is complete insanity. Still holding on to the title by the skin of their teeth. I thought it was. Boogie Man with his grip since Steve. Boogie Man. The title's in jeopardy here. Riding the pair. Turn of events. One way ends and another begins. Boogie Man's win over Tommy Wilcox may have far reaching implications as far as the Sinister Minister and the Sectarians are concerned. Finally, another look at the Montreal House Show, with the American Dream Dusty Rhodes ending the month's long reign of Ric Flair as King of Legends champ, and what an upset it was.
been a number of years since Dusty Rhodes held championship gold in RWL, and the American Dream has now claimed one of the top titles in the Legends division for himself. Well, that's going to do it for this edition of Highlight Reel, and as always, we thank you, our viewers for supporting what we do here at RWL. This has been Colin, for RWL Highlight Reel, and we'll see you next time.